I was kind of freaking out when he said he was going to have to take the van a little bit, but I don't know. I think I'm going to be fine. I'm literally just like I'm camping for two or three days. I'm just on a camping trip. Got my hammock set up. I got my rain coverage. I got my supplies. I got plenty of food for probably those two to three days. So I'm probably going to make a sandwich right now, actually. I threw my bag down over there in that spot under that tree and it literally landed on top of shit like I'm pretty sure there's a saying about that I can't make this stuff up that's that's poop that was on it's still on my bag and I'm cleaning it off but I threw my bag down and out of all the spots it could have landed on it landed on a pile of shit there you go Kind of not, uh, not heating the spot that much, honestly. I got great Wi-Fi. I got the, all the food I need. The food I have will probably last me, like, a week to two weeks, honestly. I got, like, four loaves of bread. And honey and peanut butter. I think it'll last for, like, two weeks. But I'm just debating in my head... If getting the tow truck or trying to get the tow truck uh, was actually worth it today, even though I got the van taken for me temporarily and, um, you know, have to pay additional money to get it towed back and, like, whatever storage or whatever. I think it was about 200 bucks extra. But it was like, it, it'll be like 200 bucks extra. And I lost the van for three days on top of that. But, um, I don't know. I have everything I need. Um, where I was in Mejia, I got transported to Weco, basically, and lost the van for three days. But, um, now that I'm in Weco, I was able to walk to a location where I could get all that food at a cheap price. And I definitely wouldn't be able to get all that food and that kind of food uh, for that much money. There's no way. And on top of that, I have Wi-Fi so I can actually upload videos and do stuff and connect to stuff. Um, and there's the spot I found is a shady spot. I would have been stuck in the sun in my van in the sun for three days until, um, you know, I could have towed it on Tuesday or I had. Or I, you know, waited till for the money to transfer. So I'm really not. I got wipes. I was using wipes for showers or baths when the money transfers. Once I get the van in, I may check into a motel or hotel for one day, but I don't think I'm gonna stay in one for longer than a day, if that. Um, I can definitely save money and keep doing what I'm doing right now. All the van's getting worked on on it. And it's pretty. I'm at by a church. This is a relatively safe area. I'm off the highway, not like a city section of the city. It's very commercial. I'm on the opposite side of a fence of a school that's going to be closed until Tuesday. So I've just found a, a golden spot, really. It's like camping with 
know, you know, with people around enough to keep any wild animals away. So, I just, I think my biggest concern is tomorrow, biggest concern is tomorrow morning is Sunday, so there's going to be church, and there are a bunch of people here Saturday night for mass, so kind of hidden if I stay in the hammock but if I go outside the hammock people can definitely see my head peeping out <laughs> poke it out so I don't know. we'll see I just probably stay concealed during mass tomorrow morning <laughs> but I'm definitely loving the spot even if it rained I'd be you know pretty hidden I can pull the uh, the hammock over me Oh, I'm on an angle to straighten out my back. But I can pull this tarp over me if it rains. I have coverage with the leaves. Another thing in a hammock I figured out, um, it was kind of messing up my back laying here for a long time. Just kind of how it was, you know, laying straight from point to point. But when I, I put my legs to the right and I put my, my head side to the left, and I kind of use like the space I have as like a pocket, like the like, pocket angles almost. And I straightened out the hammock where I'm laying and now. My back's a lot more comfortable than it was just laying in the hammock, you know, uh, straight from point to point, not on, an not on a slight angle. But being on a slight angle definitely makes my back feel a lot better. Straightens out the hammock. If it's a little too curved. 